Hello everyone, it's Brett here, Lionheart84, and um, just got home from work and I thought it would uh, be a nice time to do a fruit tasting. Something that, a fruit that, as far as I can remember, I've never eaten in my whole life and I just happened to see them in the shops yesterday and I thought it would be fun to try it and try them out with everyone and see what they are. Now this is called an achacha or Ashasha. I mean it looks like a dance doesn't it? Cha Cha. But it's A-C-H-A-C-H-A. -A -A. Uh, I'm sure someone could tell me whether it's Ashasha or a Cha Cha. And of course this, I'm not sure until I play the video back if this is going to be back to front or not. Probably is. I mean obviously I'm looking at it and it's showing us back to front. But um, well anyway we'll see what happens when it comes out of the video. Now this is the uh, this is a fruit now this is one of the mangosteen family, um, but whereas I've tried this little scar on that one, but that's no problem. Whereas I've obviously eaten mangosteen lots of times before, I've never had this achacha. Um, apparently it grows in slightly uh, cooler conditions than the mangosteen. The mangosteen is one of those real tropical fruits, but um, it is in the same family and I'll put the Latin name on it, uh, obviously when I edit the video and I thought it'd be interesting to see what it tastes like because I've absolutely no idea and there's very few videos around them so I thought we'll just cut it in half and have a look and see what the inside looks like. Now I've looked online a little bit and from what I can make out from what I can make out you can actually make a drink out of blending the skin as well so I'm assuming that the skin is perfectly edible okay so that's what it looks like inside as you can see well it had that little scar on it there's a little bit of discoloration on the flesh but i don't think it's going to cause a major problem though. so i presume if you can make drinks out of it the skin is probably edible certainly not poisonous mm, tastes very bitter to me but the fruit might not be that right so i'm assuming that you just blend it in with, I think you mix it with water and sugar, so it should be interesting to see what it has. So all we need to do is, it's got a sort of a white flesh inside. And I'm hoping that possibly there'll be a seed in here, because I might like to try growing the seed and see what happens. So let's see what this tastes like. It comes out of the seed casing very, very simply. This is the one with the scar on was the worst one. I've left the others for another time. So let's just see what it tastes like. Very pleasant. It's quite similar to a mangosteen actually. Quite soft and very sweet. I heard they have quite a large seed compared to the flesh. So let's see. I think it's a bit tangier than the mangosteens I've had, but as I don't know what it's meant to taste like, It's quite, it is soft and sweet, the flesh, but I'm not good at describing anything, so I can't tell you it tastes like something else. Oh yes, it's got a very substantial seed in it. I'd say that's considerably bigger than the seeds that you would normally see in a mango steam. Now, I know that mango steam seeds lose their viability literally within a day or two, well, within a day of coming out of the being taken out the fruit and I also suspect that these um, these may be the same problem but I'll put this in a damp uh, in a damp tissue for a day a day or so just to keep it fresh because I'm probably not going to be able to pot it up until the weekend I haven't got any time so anyway that's an achacha or a shasha first time I've ever tried one just showing them again it's quite a nice orange size fruit I suppose it's about the size of a size of an apricot or a, or a largish plum the one I had is probably the smallest one of the three I've saved the others for another day so uh, perhaps I'll try another one now while we're on video might as well spin it out another minute or two so we'll just try this one see what this looks like inside 
yeah see no discoloration on that one because it hasn't got any damage on it so let's just pop this out Yeah, it tastes the same as the other. A little bit lemony they are. Slight citrus flavour to it. Let's see if I can get the rest of this seed out. Very pleasant. Never seen them before. Worth trying once. I've eaten most tropical fruits, but... I haven't tried these and again decent sized seed in that so um, hopefully there's a chance that one of these will germinate and we'll see what happens I'm only having about 50% success rate with tropical seed germination at the moment that might be because it's winter still we'll see what happens thanks everybody for watching that was my Ashasha or Achacha seed tasting someone can tell me if I'm pronouncing it completely wrong um, I have got some other fruits to taste, so I'll make some videos on those as well. Um, thanks very much for watching. You're welcome to uh, like the video or give it a thumbs down. Won't be offended. Obviously, if you can subscribe to my channel, I'd be really pleased. And you can share the video if you think anybody else would like to know what a chacha is like to taste. And obviously, if you want to see my future videos, and I've got a couple more tastings coming up, then by all means, hit the bell and you'll be notified about those videos. Thanks for watching. Brett out for now.